So we've never stopped asking what if. About seven years ago, I was visiting an elder asking questions about what would you like to see in a care home. These were our early research days. About two o'clock on a Wednesday afternoon, I saw all these people's energy level go way up. And, and I started to ask, oh, what's going on? And they said, well, the therapy animals, about 10 of them, they come in once a week for about an hour. And as soon as they left, the energy level went, oh. And I wrote in my notes, I remember writing it as clear as day, what if? What if this could happen 24 hours a day in a lodge instead of one hour a week? Welcome. <laughs> Welcome to Red Maple Lodge. This is Mary Ann. She will be our resident therapy dog. She's more than just a therapy dog. She will live with the residents and greet them at any time of the day. We chose the Collie because they are relatively clean breed and very affectionate and loyal. We utilize Marianne both in marketing and in pet therapy. We like to take her out to a lot of the health fairs to get her out into the community so people can really see what we're doing with her in the lodges as well as outside. Um, it's really fun to see people's reactions in Marianne when we take her out because a collie is not a super common thing in Florida, but they really just love to pet her and love on her. There's kids that come up and hug her like a big live teddy bear. It's so much fun to see her out in the community and see people embrace her. Just like you would have a pet in your own home, it's, it's life that continues to circulate around you. She's always there. She's a constant companion. She's always happy to see you. She's always willing to take a treat out of your hand. And she's a, the best welcoming committee for your friends and family when you come over. <laughs> 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 